My strawberries are starting to produce and the birds have found them and have been coming and pecking and taking bites. So it's time for me to build a covering, put some bird netting up. So as you can see, temporarily, this has been working. Just putting these plastic containers over the top to keep the birds out. But I need something more permanent. So it's time to build a covering. In the past, I've used cattle panels to make trellises and that's worked pretty well. So instead of doing a PVC pipe or any kind of hoops, I'm just gonna use a cattle panel again to make an arch and then cover that with bird netting. So I have a 16 foot cattle panel. I'm gonna cut that in half. Now I'm just going to cut some strips of the bird netting. My son helps me lay them across the top. And then we'll use some clothespins to clip them to the bottom of the cattle panel. That way the wind doesn't blow it around while I go ahead and get it all in place. Here's a close-up view. Just took the clothespin and connected it to the bottom of the cattle panels to hold the bird netting in place temporarily. Now I'm going to take some metal U-clips and I'm just going to pull the bird netting down and stabilize it in place, pressing it into the ground. I'm going to do this on all sides. I actually ended up going back and taking those out and putting them inside the garden bed right next to the cattle panel. That way I could more easily come back and edge and mow. I go around to do it on all sides. And I'll get the next strip, lay it across the middle, and repeat this same process using the clothespins to hold it in place. A 
I'll put one last one here on the edge. Now I'm using twist ties to hold it into place. I decided to use rocks here on this kind of door area. That way I could easily remove the bird netting when I want to pick strawberries. Here's a finished view. Here's a close-up of the twist ties. These are just extras that I had laying around. It's time to pick some strawberries. Bird netting has been installed. It was very easy and inexpensive. And here's my first harvest of strawberries. Thanks for watching and please subscribe.